Hi everyone! Welcome to the Planisphere Academy webinar. This session will be dedicated to learning all about Academy, how it works, and how it can boost user adoption and productivity. If you have any questions, you can drop them in the questions tab in the bottom right corner. We are going to start with the presentation of Academy, and then we'll move on to the live Q&A sessions to answer all your questions. My name is Carla, and I am a member of the Planisphere Academy training team. My name is Alex, and today I'll be a project manager at Acme. So, Carla, at Acme, we have been using Planisphere for a few months and are generally satisfied, but I think my team could use some basic training to make sure that we are using the system correctly. Hi, Alex! I'm glad you're enjoying Planisphere Enterprise. What exactly are your needs in terms of training? Well, for the past couple of months, we've been using Planisphere as sort of a base level, but I feel like with extra training, we could use it to its full potential. I wanted to know if you have any training programs available for me and my team. I think we have the perfect solution for you. At Planisphere, we have developed a platform called Academy. It contains training content that can address your needs and help you and your team get familiar with the system. Oh, I don't know if it's the right fit for us to have a new platform. It's really annoying to have to remember an extra username and password. I get it, but that won't be an issue here. Connecting to your Planisphere Academy is very easy, thanks to our integrated SSO authentication. It is automatically linked to your Planisphere ID, so there is no extra username or password to learn, and everything is secure. Once you're connected, you land on your home page, which displays all your available learning plans. They were designed with our users in mind, based on feedback we've gotten and points of difficulties our users have brought up. What type of training content do you have? The main focus of the Academy platform is the Administrator Learning Plan, which is divided into four levels, each one being more advanced than the last. It goes from Associate, to Contributor, to Specialist, to finally Experts. Each of these four learning plans includes an average of 10 training modules. Once you complete one learning plan, you can move on to the next one. The goal is to go from associate level to expert level. So, all I need to do is complete all these courses once and I'll be considered a Planisphere expert? You can follow these training courses as often as you'd like. And at the end of the learning plan, you should have the proper amount of skill to use Planisphere like an expert. However, if you want to be officially recognized as an expert, we offer a certification for each difficulty level of the Administrator Learning Plan. How does the certification process work? It's simple. At the end of each level, you'll have the choice to pass an exam. These exams have an official certifying value, and when you pass them, you'll be awarded a badge for each level. You can then display your certification on social media, and let everyone on LinkedIn know that you are a Planisphere associate, or a contributor, or a specialist, or expert, depending on the level of certification you've attained. Okay, that's good to know. I can see how this training program can be beneficial for the administrators in my team, but it might be too much information for the others. For example, Jeremy is one of our key users here at Acme. So although he needs more knowledge than the typical end user, he doesn't need to go through the administrator learning plan or to be certified. And on the other hand, Marianne, with another member of my team, will only need to work on some reporting aspects of the projects, so I don't see the point in enrolling her in this program either. I understand. And you're right. Not every user needs to be a Planisphere expert. In this case, we also offer a few other training plans. Our discovery training plan would be perfect for Jeremy. It covers the essential information for a key user's knowledge of Planisphere. Mariam could benefit from our PEX-focused learning plan, which is specific to our reporting module and will surely help her in her daily activities. We also have another program that covers parametric equations, if you need it. Oh, that's perfect. Now I'm curious. Can we look at how the platform works? So, we've already had a quick look at the homepage, which includes a preview of our course catalog, a focus on the last updated courses, and even a calendar to remind you of any scheduled learning sessions. To find a specific course, 
you can go to the catalogue to see every course in its respective learning plan. Or, you could also use the search bar to look for a course using keywords. Can you show me what a typical training course looks like? Here is an example of one of our modules, Data Model and Data Management Part 1. The training modules in our admin path all follow a specific structure. To learn about a subject, the learner follows a series of use cases during which they will try to solve a client's problem. In the lessons, the client has a question about how to use Planisware, and we try to answer it and then give a few extra tips. I like having realistic examples from clients, but I wish we could see these tutorials in action in Planisware. Most use cases do include a video that illustrates the lesson. It is a step-by-step -step tutorial that is easy to follow and shows how to actually implement the solution in Planisware. Okay, so courses include both lessons and videos? Yes, and that's not all. At the end of each course, you'll get a recap of the most important information. Each course is also followed by a short quiz which is usually around 5 to 10 questions long. The results don't count towards your final certification. They just serve as a knowledge checkpoint. You can pass them as often as you'd like. Okay, that's good. This seems like it could take a lot of time to go through all the steps for one training. What if I need to take a break or stop the training before I finish? Do I lose my progress? Oh, of course not! You can stop and resume a training session at any point in time without losing your progress. You might notice that, in the summary on the side of your screen, there are little icons that indicate the completion status. If you want to pick up a course and you don't remember which course you started, you can go to your training progress board for an overview of all the courses assigned to you, sorted by progress status. Alright! I have another concern. I understand the importance of training, but that doesn't test how well I can actually use the tool. How can I follow these tutorials in the lessons and videos if I don't want to mess up the data in my Planisphere environment? That's a great question. Once you've bought a learning plan, you will have access to a dedicated training environment in which you can follow along to the tutorials and practice your Planisphere skills. This training environment includes a base amount of data for you to play with, and it resets every month. This way, you can practice and follow tutorials on your own without actually messing with your production data. Oh, that's good to know. But what if I have questions or difficulties that I need to address? Is there a Planis for expert I can reach out to? We've got you covered! Your subscription to Academy includes weekly Q&As with Planis for trainers. These sessions follow a different theme each week, and you're encouraged to share your thoughts or questions about the subject that you need more information on. Okay, that's helpful. I was wondering about another thing. As manager of my team, I'm responsible for overseeing my team's training progress and to decide which training content to buy. What is the process for all of this? Um, Will I need to call you every time I want information about our training KPIs or to get new training content? We tried making this process as simple as possible. So, you have extra features as Team Manager on Academy. The Manager view allows you to monitor your team's training efforts very easily. As you can see, you have your own dashboard, which gives you an overview of your team's training progress. You can get reports on their advancement, and even send reminders to those who are behind. You can also access our training catalog, which has the list of all the training content that's for sale, and you can buy it directly through Academy. This would be very useful, thank you. I see that our time is running out, but I'm very interested in learning more about Academy, and I also had some additional questions about pricing, for example. When could we discuss this further? You can find all the information about our learning plans and course pricing on our website at www.planisware.com. Additionally, you can learn more about our products by joining us at our annual user conference in Paris 
from October 17th to October 19th. It's always nice here to meet in person. You can sign up on our website if you'd like to join us. Great, see you there. Thank you all for following along. We are now going to move on to the live Q&A session to try and answer all your questions.